this is the way towards the hill, top of the hill. From both of the sides is the metals, but uh, the traffic is not allowed because people can walk by this road. This is the, the residential hostels area for Chinese students, bachelors mostly. They live here. Masters and PhD students hostels are on the other side of our uh, this top of the hill. I am visiting this area after a long time. During pandemic, we walk to this area day by day, and sometimes we regularly camp for a evening walk. Have a look here. How the food is delivered to the Chinese. Uh, Students like a uh, student is here taking the food that is uh, delivered here. They put the food here and they send a message to the students. They come and uh, they pick their own food by the coupon number which is written on their, their food. So the food is delivered here, just everything is online. And uh, one special thing here in China is that the population is so much so they manage this uh, by common uh, they make common washrooms common uh, residential halls for them undergraduate six students are living together in their own room and uh, master four students and PhD is also for students living together and they have common washing centers and uh, common washrooms for uh, have a bath time in a week and uh, bath is also expensive it cost uh, about 15 yuan for, for bath so it means nearly it cost us uh, uh, one 1.5 dollar or approximately 2 dollars 2 dollars one bar so students uh, book uh, their appointment for a bath then they go for a bath once or two times in a week and they manage these things by common and these guys check these have taken on their hands the uh, baskets where they put uh, their washing stuff to have a bath after class and uh, I like this habit so much because after classes they all try to have a bath do a lot of exercise and get fresh and this is a common habit of all Chinese to have a bath in the evening and they go early towards their work <laughs> 